Hey, this is James. I just wanted to today, today to talk about uh, the Explorer Scientific AR-102. It's a pretty cheap telescope. I bought mine. It was uh, $2.99. I think right now they run close to 4 but they're, you know, fairly cheap, you know, for a telescope. Um, I have a house here in a Pelican uh, 1650 case. So let's show this. Sorry about the mess. We're cleaning the garage out and I got to throw all this trash away. Uh, just a note, don't ever buy a truck with a fin. It's hard to uh, load the trash in and stuff. Okay, as you can see, the 102's here. And I installed a uh, Orion bar. It actually came with the screws and everything. It fits right into this handle, nice and easy. Just screw it right in. So that gives me an extra bar. So if I want to put an auto guider or anything, I could put it just slide it in right here. That was about $30. It's pretty cheap. Okay, so the 102 is a refractor telescope. And one of the nice things about this telescope is it came with a really nice di diagonal. Uh, these things can cost like a hundred bucks. So if I bought this for three hundred dollars, that means a hundred of that was this. So really, the telescope only cost me. Uh, $200 because this is a two inch and they're a lot more expensive than the little you know one and a quarter or whatever one and a half whatever the spotting scope it's really nice it's a nice real quality here so that was that came with it and that's really you know high quality obviously it's a cheaper telescope but so it's not going to have some of the better pieces of glass that are in it uh, the ED glass or may not have quite the the best coatings and because of that you're going to get like a purple fringe around some of your photos. Like if you took a picture of the moon, you're going to get a purple ring around the edge. Now you can clean that up easily in Photoshop or Lightroom or whatever you're using, but that is going to be one of the drawbacks. But for three or four hundred dollars, that I see that that's worth it. It's a really well-made telescope. It's nice and solid. Um, all the pieces here, you know, really nice. They don't feel cheap or really plasticky. Every, everything is really solid on this telescope. So if you're looking for that first telescope and not really sure if you want to get into it, this is a really good purchase. You're going to need a decent mount to put it on. Uh, I think this thing weighs maybe uh, 10, 12 pounds maybe. So you're going to need a you know, decent you know, mount to put it on. And if you get a case, it travels really well. That keeps for all the dust off, and then it's easy to just take this with you. It has wheels on it, and you can just go to whatever site you are, and you can be up and running in maybe 15, 20 minutes each. Well, this is a really short video. I'm just showing you different options. Um, this is my t first telescope that I ever bought. In fact, I didn't even have a mount when I even bought it because I, I just wanted a telescope so bad. I don't think you'll be upset if you got this, the AR-102. It's really, really pretty sharp telescope. In fact, I've never used a telescope yet that wasn't really decently sharp. So, if this is, you know, if you're, if you're on a budget, this is great. Thank you.